Jiggy Jake TV, Community Access Television, the Lost Road Show on Access, the number one hell. And uh, we're out here at the Eric Stein. Eric Stein stage. I just got done slapping Eric Stein in the face. No, I didn't. And uh, go ahead and introduce yourself so people know where to write the complaint letters if they've seen the interview. Oh, then no way I'm giving you a false name. <laughs> That's right. False name. No, Hamilton Loomis from Galveston, Texas, and uh, my group and I just uh, performed here for the Outdoor Concert Series here in Salina, and uh, we had a great time. Great Where's job. the rest of your band in? Oh, they're, they're just around. Come on in, guys. <laughs> oh, like, we did a wide shot. Where the hell did the rest of your band go? Oh, yeah. I'm like, we were ready to go. Let's go on it. We <laughs> got this drummer, he just kind of like was out there like hanging out. Like, you got everybody in the shot here? Apparently. Uh, I don't care if I'm in the shot, just get the whole band out of here. Okay. Well, here. I got you. I'm Greg, not the star in this whole thing. Out, out the so, okay. you guys are going here's, this is Greg, and that's Ryan, and yeah, here comes uh, Mr. Is Mr. Saxophone. Yeah, that piece of pizza there. Out of the We're here, we're here. Well, gentlemen, give you a little information on the group. Where you guys uh, uh, came from? And Drove Where are you all going to and what the hell's going on? There? Drove all the way up from Houston, Texas. So we're based in Houston, Texas, but uh, along the way we picked up Greg, who lives in Denver, and uh, we picked up Stratton here, who lives in Louisiana, and uh, we just uh, hop in, and do the gigs, and uh, it's been a, it's been a really crazy week. Last week was a great week. We had a, a bunch of concerts just like this one uh, up in Colorado, and um, wow. uh, lots yeah. of fun. Lots of fun. Yeah. Lots of fun. So. Did you guys have to wear coats when you're in Colorado playing outside? Oh, no. Like, well, well, one night. I was one night in Dillon. Yeah. And yeah. yeah. Dillon. Dillon. Yeah. It got really, really, really cold. I had to loan Hamilton a shirt. Too. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, he did. <laughs> <laughs> I was in, I was, what was it, 9,100 feet? Yeah. It's yeah, cold. Like it was cold yeah. before the show, and it actually warmed up when we started to play. Yeah, because yeah. it rained and stuff and during the day. So, but, um, yeah, but we, we like cold weather because we all we have is you know heat and humidity down in Texas. So. Yeah. Kind of felt like home minus a little bit of humidity. Yeah, it's cool. Yeah, so, uh, so uh, give me a little information on the music. What do you guys? What would you describe your music as? Well, the running joke is take a listen and maybe you can tell us. Exactly. Because it's, <laughs> it's a mix. It's a mix of, of roots music and blues, but we put a little funk, a little bit of rock, and then a little bit of R and B, and it just kind of comes out what it is, along with uh, you know some uh, Bo Diddley tribute stuff. Exactly. Too. We did some, some Bo Diddley tunes. Yeah. Uh, we every now and then again uh, we'll do some uh, Johnny Guitar Watson stuff sure. like that, yeah. or maybe even a Stevie Wonder here and there. You yeah. know, we keep it, we keep it real true. Oh, right? You know, as far as that's <laughs> yeah, I mean, because it's like. Industry, so you know, it's, it's a lot of cookie cutter stuff going around. And, yeah, you know, we try to keep it where it's supposed to be. Exactly, yeah. exactly. So yeah. that's cool. Yeah. But, uh, about uh, about ninety percent of the show is uh, original stuff. Um, wow. And, uh, yeah. So, so uh, what was the deal with you guys disappearing into the crowd every once in a while? <laughs> you just get tired of playing on stage. Well, it's more like giving back, you know, because all all the people they'll come out and support us, you know, and they're 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 buying CDs, they're telling their friends and family about the shows and everything, getting more people involved. So it's kind of like, you know, we're just up on the stage, we're kind of separate, you know, and occasionally, you know, we just like to go out and you know, kind of give back to them. If they came to see us, we're like, we're gonna go see them. You yeah. know what I mean? That's how That's I like cool. to look at it. Yeah, I like to go out and just talk to people while I'm playing. You know, the whole duel thing, I'll, I'll trash talk him while we're dueling to the people that are around me. You know, <laughs> yeah, no, no, you know you're fired. Right? Yeah. <laughs> I was going to say, I've been talented to talk to people and play saxophone at the same time. Right? Yeah. Uh, I, I got skills yeah. like that. I, I have to I kind of like to... That's it. Yeah. 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 Kenny G can hold notes out for a long time. I can talk while I play. That's there it. you go. <laughs> I always knew you were talking out of your ass. So. Oh! 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 Can I say that on camera? <laughs> 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 So you guys can play with any two bands or artists, Living, Dead, Broke Up, whatever. Who are the two uh, um, artists or musicians? Uh, Did you say Living or Dead? Living, living Dead. Or the band living or up. Dead. Uh, single artist would be Michael Brecker, a saxophone player, and if I had my like dream gig, sorry buddy, would be... Uh, <laughs> Be <laughs> 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 one of the horns in uh, Tower of Power. Wow. Yeah. Um, 
to to hopefully nothing ever happens to you, Carter. But Dave Matthews Band for one, and you don't want to win. You don't know what's going on. Hey man, Carter broke his leg. We're looking for somebody. Uh, yeah, this guy right here. But, uh, <laughs> and another another folk, another another band. Uh, I think it's really really excellent. Uh, huge interest and in, uh, inspiration to me, Stevie Wonder. So definitely nice. That was That's one of mine too. So. Oh. Yeah. Probably someone like Prince would be a good, that was my good challenge. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know? There's a new guy out I really like called Martin Luther. I haven't listened to him. Oh, yeah. Nice. He's, he's, yeah. Smoking. Yeah. he's got the boots playing but in his band. His band so. yeah. Yeah. And my two have already been mentioned. Pretty much, I would say Prince and Stevie Wonder are probably my two all-time favorites. Because uh, they've, they've, they've got the funk. They've also got you know so much musicianship and so much talent. And uh, they're, they're fantastic singers, fantastic instrumentalists. And they just write great songs, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. just you know those those would be my two right there. So mm -hmm. well, definitely. Cool. Well, I ain't jump in there. You always got questions. Well, I'm, yeah. She's taking notes of them. What is <laughs> one of your names? Because I didn't catch that. Ooh. Who are you? Go ahead and introduce yourself. Good one. Okay. Good one. Good one. I'm Stratton. Okay. S T R A T T O N Doyle. Like the guitar? Yeah. <laughs> Stratton, like Strat, like the guitar, and Doyle, like Doyle Grandma. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> play anything else besides sax? I just learned how to play keys like four months ago. So. Wow. Good teacher. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I've been behind. I can't 